Good morning. Tuesday started out as your average day as kids boarded a bus to head to Ralphie Waite Elementary in the Medina School District. But what nearly happened to the bus on Route 57 near Route 162 sends shivers up the police chief's spine. This could have been devastating to our community, uh, into the whole county, to the whole area. With the bus pulled over in the northbound lane, its lights flashing and its stop sign arm out, a bus driver who was training a new driver is alarmed by the sound of a horn. A horn behind her. An 80,000 pound tractor trailer hauling sand and with its own camera on board was barreling towards the back of the bus. The driver unable to stop the truck. You can hear the stress in his voice. Stop, 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 no! He started downshifting, hitting the brakes and realized he's not stopping. Cameras also capture a car behind the bus, pull off the road and a pickup in the southbound lane, back up and into an SUV to make room for the oncoming tractor trailer terrifying moments for Josh Click behind the wheel of that pickup. I'm just kind of sitting there. Next thing I know, I hear a, a horn blaring. Um, and I look up and I realize there was a uh, tractor trailer heading down uh, my way head on. Police estimate the semi was going 40 to 45 miles an hour as it weaved around the bus without hitting any of the vehicles and avoiding disaster. In 15 seconds, he had to make a decision. Where am I putting this 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 80,000 pound truck? Josh's quick thinking in his pickup may have also saved lives. So I had to do what I had to do to protect myself and the kids. It was one of those moments where you realize uh, things can happen in an instant. Back on that bus with multiple views of the near miss with a tractor trailer, there was both shock and relief. See what I mean? Oh my God. Who was that? You don't want to know. The driver eventually got the semi to stop about a quarter of a mile down the road. Police believe he called someone from the trucking company and was very rattled. I'm standing on it, nothing's happening, all of a sudden the buzzer goes off. I can't stop, it's not slowing down. While police are grateful a disaster was averted, there are still questions. Police were not initially aware of the potential brake failure, and the semi driver drove it back to a truck yard before officers had a chance to talk to him. Charges are possible. Certainly, uh, that's something we're going to look at. There's a school bus violation. Is it an unsafe vehicle? I, I don't know. Montville Township Police say the Motor Carrier Division of the State Highway Patrol did an inspection of the tractor trailer. Officers are waiting for the findings before determining if the driver or the trucking company will be charged. In Montville Township, Bob Jones, News 5.